بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم and this is the um, first news on 7th February newspaper front page dawn ordinance of a open senate vote promulgated move conditional on Supreme Court verdict on presidential reference experts term 8 presumptive legislation by Amr Hussein. Islamabad, two days after abandoning its efforts to get the Constitution Amendment Bill for an open Senate vote passed through the National Assembly, and without waiting for a Supreme Court's decision on the presidential reference on the issue, the government on Saturday promulgated an ordinance amending the Elections Act 2017 for the use of an open and identifiable ballot in the coming and future Senate elections. And the text of the one page ordinance titled the Elections Amendment Ordinance 2021. 21 was released by a federal minister for information and broadcasting visibly Faraz through his official social media account on Twitter hours after Pakistan People's Party Chairman Bilal Bhutto Zadari declared at a press conference that any such that any such move by the government would be illegal and unconstitutional and would um, amount to influence the Supreme Court. The government had on Friday obtained the federal cabinet's approval of the ordinance through circulation. Interestingly, the next shows that the ordinance has come into force at once, but an amendment to section 122 of the Sections Act 2017 has made it conditional on the final decision of the Supreme Court on the presidential reference. It says, provided that in case the Supreme Court of Pakistan gives an opinion in reference number one of 2021, filed under Article 186 of the Constitution, that elections for the members of Senate do not fall within the purview of Article 226 of the Constitution, the vote for elections for members of the Senate to be held in March 2021, and hereafter shall be conducted by the Commission, Election Commission of Pakistan, through open and identifiable ballot. Uh, provided the further uh, that after the elections of our members of Senate, if the head of the uh, political party requests the com commission to show the ballot cast by any voting member of his party, the commission shall show the same to the head of the political party or his nominee, the next say, the text says. Whereas it is expedient further to amend the Elections Act 2017, 33 of 2017, and whereas the Senate and the National Assembly are not in session and the President of the Islamic Republic of Pakistan is satisfied that the circumstances exist which render it necessary to take immediate action now Therefore, in exercise of the powers conferred by Clause 1 of Article 89 of the Constitution of the Islamic Republic of Pakistan, the President is pleased to make and promulgate The ordinance says the text at the beginning justifying the government's move despite the fact 
that the president had himself pro prorogued the sessions of both the Houses of Parliament only a day before. A member of the federal cabinet had told Don that the government wanted promulgation of the ordinance before the announcement of scheduled for the Senate elections. The schedule is likely to be announced on February 11. We have very little time to make amendments to the Constitution, and because of this, the ordinance is being promulgated, the minister had said on Friday. On the other hand, several legal experts termed the promulgation of the ordinance as presumptive legislation since the Supreme Court has not yet decided the uh, presidential weapons which the government has filed to seek interpretation of Article 226 of the Constitution and explored the possibility of open balloting for Senate elections. Senior lawyer Hamid Khan said being an ordinary law, an ordinance could never overrule the Constitution, which was a supreme legislation. He said promulgation of the ordinance at a time when the Supreme Court was still examining the matter and the National Assembly had already rejected the move was beyond comprehension. He believed that it was not a proper a proper time and um, a situation to promulgate the ordinance. Advocate of the Supreme Court, Kashif Ali Malik said, Apparently, the ordinance had been issued under the presumption that the Supreme Court might decide the matter within a certain deadline or before the Senate elections. And to some extent, he said it might be um, seen as influencing the funding and proceeding before the Apex Court. Law Minister Farouk Nassim could not be contacted for his comment on the development despite attempts. Last week, the government, despite clearly lacking numbers in the parliament, uh, had tabled the 26th Constitution Amendment Bill in the National Assembly to hold Senate votes through open vote without trying to take the opposition on board. The opposition parties had not only rejected the move, but lost a strong, noisy protest in the National Assembly when Speaker Asad Kesar put the bill before the House for a general discussion. On Thursday, and the National Assembly had witnessed a scuffle between the Treasury and the opposition members when Deputy Speaker Qasem Suri uh, ran the House one sidedly and the given floors to three federal ministers, one after the other, providing them a fully opportunity to speak on the bill and bash the opposition parties. In November last year, Prime Minister Imran Khan had voted a hold election, to hold elections for the uh, Super House of Parliament through show of hands and not by a secret ballot to ensure transparency and eliminate vote trading and the practice of the use of money. The opposition alleged that the government is doing all of this and because it was no, uh, it has no control and trust on uh, his uh, lawmakers and um, fears that they may not vote for the candidates backed by the ruling um, alliance.
At the present, the opposition is in majority in the Senate and the government has become a desperate as many times a legislation passed by the National Assembly was rejected by the Senate. As many as 52 senators, 50% of the 104 member house are sent to retire on March 11 after completing their six-year tenure. However, this time there will be no polling for the four seats of the erstwhile officially administered tribal areas because of its merger with the Khyber Pakhtunkhwa province. Therefore, polling will be held to elect 48 senators. Well, it's from KP and Balochistan, 11 each from Punjab and Sindh, and two from Islamabad. Polling will be held to elect seven members on table seats, two on seats reserved for women, and two technocrats seats in the four provinces. Besides this, the election for one minority seat each in KP and Balochistan will also be conducted. When the MPAs will elect senators from the provinces, members of the National Assembly will be voting to elect a senator on general seat and another on a woman seat from Islamabad. Malik Hassan also contributed to the report. And in the end, for the request, if you have not yet, please subscribe our channel and press the like and bell button to get the first message. Thank you for watching. Have a nice time. Goodbye.